8 o'clock and we're getting some new information on the breaking news we've been following out of Indianapolis. Eight people are dead in a mass shooting overnight at a FedEx facility near the Let's airport. Let's get right to WSBT 22's Lauren Becker, who is at the live desk as more information comes in. Lauren, you're learning brand new details about the incident. Leanna, a reporter at our affiliate station in Indianapolis, confirms the FBI has now joined the investigation and reports say President Biden has been made aware of this incident. Here's what we know so far about this shooting, though. Eight victims were killed and several others were hurt. We know at least four victims are in the hospital, including one in critical condition. The deputy chief of criminal investigations for Indianapolis actually told CNN the shooting probably lasted one to two minutes. He says the suspect exited his vehicle and immediately began shooting while in the parking lot. The suspect then entered the facility and continued shooting. Officers then came to the scene and they believe the suspect encountered police officers inside the facility and then took his own life. Our affiliate spoke to a woman with who has a family member who works at the FedEx facility. A representative from FedEx just confirmed her family member is safe. And the um, the young lady that helped me, you know, kind of gave me a little jolt because she asked me her name three times. And then she asked me if I had her phone number. And I, then, you know, of course, the anticipation and all this and then the worry starts to happen, you know, and I had to repeat that. So but she she's OK. And police say there is no ongoing threat at this time. We're expected to hear more from police at 1030 this morning. Stay with WSBT 22 as we continue following this developing story. At the live desk, Lauren Becker, WSBT 22 News.